Hey, what is up gamers and welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy 16. I know it's been a couple of days since we kind of left off. I, I think I kind of burnt myself out of this game, I'm not going to lie. Uh, but we're back, I just needed to take a break. I mean, this game just draws on so long. I love it, but it's going on for so long. Uh, but we do have a new game coming out at the end of this week, so I kind of want to try and knuckle down and get it done. I did do some of the side quests, I also did some of the hunting boards, but I'm, I'm just going to try and knock the game out at this point. I don't care for the side quests. I'll pick them up, I can do them in my own time, but... My old goal is to beat the game at this point. I think we're like 70% through, I was told. So, hopefully, we can get through this soon. I love it, but it, it, the story is so long. Yeah, Everything's updating. I mean, I haven't even been on my PlayStation in like four days or something. I think we have quite a few updates. Clive. We knew this was going to happen. Well, not the bleeding skies part, but you take my point. Now's not the time to second guess yourself. Now's the time to visit the infirmary. Taya says your brother's awake. Thank you, Otto. Oh, can you go on a journey with us? I want to see more battles with Clive and Joshua teaming up. Oh, the prince is still there. Dion, that's his name. So it was not Sylvester, but Olivier who served as Ultima's puppet. And when Dion learned of this, he sought to slay the fiend. Oh, rumble as well. Only for his father to take the spear that would have freed him. Enough to drive a man to madness. Small wonder he hasn't stirred. Be afraid to wake. Had I but reached out to him sooner, warned him of the threat Ultima posed. But now, both an empire and her prince lie broken. I mean, I'm glad their mother's dead. Joshua. God, I could not stand that witch. What do you know? She was an asshole. You never have to see her again, though. Very little, I'm afraid. Oh, and legends. Despite my oh, best gonna have efforts. Eighteen years ago, as I lay buried beneath the rubble of Phoenix Gate, it was not death who came for me, but another. And it was while in my rescuer's care, I first heard of Ultima. I've been chasing his shadow ever since. Ultima is driven by some deep, dark purpose, and for whatever reason, it would seem you are crucial to his designs. He will stop at nothing to have you, even if that means toppling an empire. But why me? What possible use could I be to such a creature? That is one of many answers that have eluded me. Yet, I am certain of this. It is not mere chance. You were chosen for a reason. All dominants carry within them the might of an icon. We have multiple. Nigh limitless power that is at once acutely limited. I wield fire and only fire. And I only ice. Eight wardens for eight elements. But you. Clive. You're like six, right? Being you six? are different. You're special. Your abilities begin with the flames of Ifrit. But they do not end there. The fact Ifrit can even exist goes against everything we thought we knew of dominance. Perhaps Ultima has been waiting for one such as you, whose potential mm, is true. We do have six, right? Limitless. No, I think we have five. I've encountered that thing several times now. If it or he, as you say, needs me, why hasn't he claimed me as he did the boy? Were I to hazard a guess, I'd say the two of you are somehow incompatible. His mind's not properly attuned to your body. His mind? Mind, awareness, spirit, call it what you wish. But I believe Ultima to be an embodiment of the concept. It is why I struggle and fail to contain him here inside me. Sorry. Inside you. <laughs> it's just gonna bring him to the hideout. With every setting sun, 
I feel my strength wane. And though the Phoenix's flames mend the prison I have made for Ultima, they do so at a cost. We must find the means to bring an end to him before I meet my own. What were you thinking? It was that or let him take Clive. And I've always had a soft spot for my brother. But that doesn't mean you should sacrifice yourself to save me. Joshua. Really? Clive, it's Gav. They should just take him far away and just let that thing go. I mean, as long as he keeps in his body, he's slowly dying, I'm pretty sure. Well, what's the short of it? Uh, it's all Talia told you. The capital of the free cities is under siege by an army of monstrosities. The city guard are doing their best to stem the tide, but numbers ain't on their side. What of Lord Byron and Mid? Were they able to escape? No. Well, they're all right for now. They're hiding with Gav at midship. Dude, Gav gets around like so we fast. Get them out of there. He just seems to be sure. always one step ahead so of everyone. He's playing stones. chess and he's always, even the bad so guys, is like exactly 40 steps is. ahead of them. Vivian, what's the swiftest route to the free cities? <laughs> that sounds like a question for the map. Look here. This road, through Tabor, should provide the least trouble. Good. What a coincidence. Tabor is exactly where I'm bound. Joshua, bed is where you should be bound. Where's his... Where's the one that was helping him? Where's she just been the exact same thing? Were Taya not such a talented healer, I would surely have been inclined to agree. Thanks to her ministrations, I feel I may safely rejoin my attendant, who was to wait for me in Tabor if we became separate. All right, we travel together. Clive! If he stays close to me, he'll be fine. Thank you, brother. Ah, they're back together. That was cute. quest to pick up i'll pick up the quest but uh yeah i'll pick it up but i'm just not i'm not gonna do them oh god there's so many of them did you see that pick them up for later as long as they're in my inventory i know i'm not gonna how many okay they just keep popping out of nowhere oh one sec do i have a new weapon or did i make a weapon at the end of last episode? i can't remember if i have a new weapon or not let's go and check what do i owe the honor sorry will it be no we already made the best the better weapon Nothing there. Okay, it. All right. Fine. Do the side quest, and we'll just move straight on then. What am I gonna do? Is everything all right, Gates? Have a look at the side quest too. You seem more discomposed than usual. Oh, I don't know what that means, but but I'm in a bit of a muddle. Oh, I think Nan might be in trouble, and she's. <laughs> it's all right. You can tell me. Uh, oh, yeah. There was a trader came by. Uh, yeah. One of our usuals, like, said he'd heard some rotten rumors about her down Dallymill Way. Folk are saying she's been selling to bandits and cutthroats and that. I mean, she's fond of a chance to make a coin or two, aye, but, but she'd never do business with baddies. Especially not the kind who go hurting people who haven't done out. I wanted to ask her about it myself, but. I'm scared she'll give us a tongue lashing. She's he's so big, but he's literally the biggest softy ever. She? Don't worry. Hang on a second, look, I Speak may... Oh, thanks, I mean, I doubt it, honestly. You'll let I'm just me picking them up. Says, if I do end up doing them, then cool, I end up doing them. If I don't, sure it's wow. all just a misunderstanding. At least I know they're not going to disappear on me because they're already in my inventory. Or in my quest log, sorry, I should be saying. We have so many. There's a. Wait, I've never. That means you. 
Oh, that's just to get in here, right. Uh, no, I don't want to do the quest. I just want to... Here, you put me in this situation, Clive. You can bloody well get me out of it. I need a hand with a recipe. Are you sure it's me you're looking for? I'm not much of a cook. I'm all the cook will be needing, thank you very much. What I want from you is a little of your time, right? Oh, and uh, perhaps your sword. You remember Ivan's stew, right? Well, despite the look of the thing and that awful stench, people wolf it down. So I thought I'd try making one of these supposed masterpieces myself. Had a peek at the book and gave it a go, but well. It wasn't as straightforward as you'd hoped. Ivan had the same problem. Yeah, but this is my blooming kitchen, and I will not be outdone. So if you don't want to be seen as playing favorites, I suggest you lend me a hand. No. I've never been one to play favorites, Molly. Okay, they're all so lazy to do their own jobs. To lend you a hand. They don't have their own so, task given to them yet. I'm the one that does everything time. for them. A fried mortress of skyworm. That's one heck of a name, innit? Recipe seemed easy enough to an old hand like myself. Thought I'd followed it to a T. Only, turns out skyworm livers and Drake's mint are not what I thought they were. At least I hope they're not, given the rancid mess they made. Ivan said the recipes in the culinary pilgrimage date back centuries. Who's to say the ingredients even exist anymore? The kid trying to steal them. Wow. That's a question for a scholar, wouldn't you say? The kid looks like he's trying to Perhaps steal some meat, uh, some bread in the background. Kindly old <laughs> fellow who him. haunts the shelves, maybe? Fine. I'll go and speak to Harpocrates. Perhaps he'll know something. And if he does, I'll see if I can find your ingredients for you. You do that. Lest we forget, you've got a reputation to uphold. You have a reputation. I don't even know who you are. I don't even know your own work. Oh good, I don't actually have to go and have to talk to whoever that is. And then we're good to move on. Now this, we're going to travel to somewhere. Sid, perhaps you can help me solve a mystery. I can certainly try. Who's gone missing this time? It's not who, but what. Mid scales, the ones she made for her workshop. I borrowed them to teach the little ones about weight, and shortly after the lesson, well, they vanished. It's definitely hidden. My first thought was that they'd taken them off somewhere to play, but when I asked, they swore they had nothing to do with their having disappeared. Which almost certainly means they had. What well, kids are going to tell the difference? They definitely hid them somewhere. Definitely. Perhaps a visit from Sid will jog their memories. <laughs> I think it just might. Thank you. I don't like to imagine that my pupils would lie to me, but if they have, I'll have no choice but to discipline them accordingly. They were in the atrium when I last saw them, as always. Okay, that's all the side quests out of the way now. Well, give or take. Now we go to try and find out where it is that we're actually heading. Are we finally going over to the other world? No. Yeah, are we ever actually going to go over here? Like, there's been an area this whole time and not once have we ever gone traveling that way. We're still stuck in this one little area. Central Dalmeki. Wait, where'd Joshua go? Oh, there he is. Walking slow. He says he's perfectly fine, but he looks like he's dying. I mean, we've got a squad now. What, the, all the siblings are back together and the dog. Good old Toggle. Cloak and Dagger. There used to be a Marvel movie, didn't it? Uh, not like a movie, a TV series. Walking like we used to. It had um, it, yeah, Olivia Holt and thing, someone else. You're right. I think I had two seasons. I only ever watched one season, but it, is the first season scout. I didn't actually mind. If Candle was attacked, she will already have begun. But then got cancelled. Tabor isn't far. We should pick up the pace. But then most Marvel things do get cancelled. Fly Ambrosia. To be honest. We can use They're the all, uh, the give or take, like, one, yeah, one or two out of, like, there, ten million they've recently released. They've all been pretty bad. I haven't even watched. There's, like, there's two Marvel movies I haven't watched. Fallen Hunter. I think they're all 
ugly things, are ya? Tell us about Yote, Joshua. Where are we actually going? Strong-willed, loyal, and deadly with a blade. Wait, does he have a choke like too? Oh, we do. Oh, everyone's got a squad of choke. Oh, hello. They killed one of the chocobos. Need to be a chocobo racing. It's another quest. All right, well, I guess we're picking up along the way. I just want to have to come back for them later. That's the only reason why I'm picking them up. Let's go for the detour. Can I talk to him? I mean, Thanks, this guy's God. dead. What quest does he possibly have? This guy's on his deathbed. You're injured. Really? What happened here? Where are your comrades? The ether flood up ahead. <clears throat> Swallowed our camp while we slept. My own men did this. Turned every last one of them. There's a village not far from here. Tabor. The people were kind to us. It's only a matter of time before they won't stand a chance. We can't let those monsters reach the... <laughs> oh God. I think he's already dead. Catch your breath. Thank you. Our encampment is up ahead. Just Unless I go track. through it, I probably won't waste my time going out of my way. They must not reach... As I said, I'm just trying to get this game done. We've been going on it, what, two months now? Forget Give or take all the other games we have. We still have three games coming out this month. We have one Friday, and then I think there's two, like, well, two weeks from now. But, uh... I'm gonna try and... When the new game drops, I'll probably get some pre-records done. You said the encampment I have close. another thing going, another project on at the moment. And it kind of takes up time. So if I get some pre-records, then I don't have to worry about stressing between the Another two of them. Ether flood. They're everywhere now. Yeah, I'm going go over north. there. Goodbye, I'm going they this way. Just have to be careful. I just want to fight something. Yeah, good. God, this thing just keeps moving. Where is the map, by the way? Okay, we're almost where we need to be. Not going to keep going back. Hopefully, I don't think so. I mean, we're still two levels higher, so we don't even need to do the side quest. If we ever get to a point where we're, like, lower level than what we should be, we're nearly there. then maybe I might go and do the side quest or something, there but... Are a few like, places I haven't. No need to ride from here. I don't really need to do them. Where now, Joshua? Oh, don't worry, we're still there going. There is a just inside the city gates. She awaits us within. Hello? Oh, the weapon looks sick, though. In that place. <laughs> Just standing there watching. Where's Joshua? Why is he not in here with us? My Lord Marquess, it is an honor. I am Yote, Knight of the Undying, charged with the protection of His Grace Joshua Rosfield, Keeper of the Flame of the Phoenix. Uh, of course. Doggo. It all makes sense now. Would you care to elaborate? The Undying are loyal servants to the Ducal Throne. Or more specifically, to its heir. They have served our family for generations, albeit from the shadows. Since their inception, they have been tasked with the preservation and enactment of the rites of ancestral communion. After the events at Phoenix Gate, it was the Undying who delivered me to safety. And since the day I left Rosaria, Yote has been my constant companion and protector. Without her sword, 
I would not have survived my journey across the realm. She doesn't look like someone who could fight, but better. looks like has been deceiving, I guess. You saved my brother. I owe you a debt I can never repay. I but did my duty. Come now, tell us what you've discovered. Your Grace, it is as you feared. The vessel we spied off the coast of the Crystalline Dominion on the night of her fall. It was the Ein Herjar. Beyond any doubt. The Black Galleon. Joshua, huh? The Ein Herjar is the Royalist flagship. What business would they have in the Dominion? Uh, upon learning of Walud's involvement in recent events at Drake's Fang, I sensed the malign influence of Ultima and bid Yote and the Undying look into the matter. We have reason to believe that the Black Galleon weighed anchor shortly after the fighting began and set a course due south. For Canva. Then it is Waluda Knights who besiege the cities. What is left of them? Yes. And the Black Galleon sails at but one man's behest. Barnabas Tharm. We still have two more Econs we need to get. Oh, we got a council. I thought the other place was the only council. It looks like we got another one. The Agora. But are we truly safe here in the Agora? The city guard have been paid, if that's what you're implying. All the more reason for them to run. Well, you are free to leave, Lord Minister. Markets abandoned, warehouses aflame, blackened house choking every port in the capital. Canva is ruined. The realm teeters on the brink of chaos, and all you can think about is commerce. Forgive us. We were not aware Dalmechia now subsisted on charity. How dare you! Were these guys at the um Oh these guys distinguished members of the council You must forgive his majesty this intrusion What did you What is the meaning of this A trifle crowded but I fear it will have to serve my liege Very well my colleagues, do you not see? The king, he has come to save us from the Akashi. Rock is probably coming to kill you all. It is a gift from the heavens, divine intervention, our very salvation. And of course, if it is compensation he requires, we would be most willing to negotiate a fair price for services rendered. Fools. Your ignorance unbecomes you. Your Majesty, correct me if I'm wrong, but I would swear that the fiends washing the cobbles of Canva with the blood of her citizens wear the colors of Walud. <laughs> So you do not deny it. Guards, better them and see our guests to the dungeons. Okay, good luck with that, bud. Prince Caspian alone is going to kill you all. This guy's Odin. Ah, yeah, you're all fucked. Goodbye. <laughs> Later. I mean, I saw this guy from Bali. He was just coming here to probably just slaughter them all. But you should imagine yourselves worthy of salvation. The girl is still here, somewhere in the city. Her consciousness fair dripping with her late father's hubris. A consciousness to which Muthos is inextricably bound and inexorably drawn. See that he is made welcome. Yes, your majesty. Come, 
with us. Surely the prince's light cannot have sated you. Okay, he killed them. I told you, he just killed them all. With one swing and he took out every single one of them. I was saying before, I'm pretty sure that was the dude, uh, the kingdom that Dion was, uh, Dion was from. When the when we first met the king, he was talking to a group of like council. I think they were the so council then, people. How long has Walud been under Ultima's control? How long indeed? Based on what we know of Barnabas' actions, I would guess some few years, mayhap more. But to what end? What does Ultima want? The tapestry. Show them. It's not worth seeing that picture countless oh, times. There's a thing in the sky. The Meek's Gate. Drake's breath and now here. But what is it? It is old, ancient, even. Nought remains of the faith it represents, save what can be gleaned from the image itself. None could tell me what the one in the apodotry meant. Even the undying. But I believe it may be the key to discerning Ultima's purpose. That figure in the center. It was like a the dragon in the like... icons congregate. That I believe to be also Ultima. doesn't. He is a god. No, it's a material, actually. Like his very existence beyond our ken. The icons, and by extension their dominance, are meant to be his subjects. And while some, like Barnabas, have accepted this role, others have rejected it. Like you, Clive. Which is rather inconvenient, as it appears he needs you most of all. And gods don't like to be disobeyed. I don't suppose they do. Clive, may I tell Yote of the lake? Uh, well, by all means. Yote, I will be accompanying my brother to the free cities. <laughs> Whilst we are afield, I would have you watch over those Clive has made his wards. Omia lost the land to his sag ilith. Though well concealed, the hideaway lacks trained fighters to defend its occupants should they be discovered. But it is my duty to... As it has ever been my brother's duty, remember. If... if that is your wish, your grace. But please be safe. If aught were to befall you, I... You have my word. I mean, he's on death's door. He doesn't really have a word to speak on. He's going to die any time. I don't want him to because I like Joshua, but... I don't see him living that entire game. Farewell, my lord. My lady. We are in your debt, Yote. Let's find our friends. I wonder what his uncle would say when he sees Joshua again, because I'm guessing he probably thinks Joshua's dead as well, right? Yeah, I couldn't even tell what that picture is. It looks like a dragon, but... It... Anyway, where are we going? It's oh no, there's more quests. And I heard. Two. Which is why I had to let her go. All right, well, let's go and pick him up too. I don't think there's a limit to how many we can hold. If there is, all them stuff, we'll just leave them. Because I have a mind to make a killing. Figuratively, I hope. Well, yes and no. A passing caravan carried with it a rumor most fortuitous for one in my trade. 
that an elder Dread Evis had been sighted in the fields of Karava. Dread Evis are aggressive beasts. Compelled as they are to acts of violence, few survive to maturity. But those that do develop a hide of phenomenal value. A hide you want to sell? Eventually, yes. Though, I would have it tanned first that it might be crafted into marvels, the likes of which the world has never seen. Dread Evis skin is a rare thing indeed. But the worked hide of a well-aged beast? Now, nah, that would fetch such coin that Gilbot himself might weep with envy. Bring me that beast's skin and I will share with you the bounty of our combined labors. Oh. Ow, just whack my knuckle. All right. I'll hunt your Evis. Of course you will. Stables are hazards. The amount of times I've whacked my knuckle in this table. It is a fool who lets opportunity slip his grasp. Leave Tabor through the east gate, but take the path that branches west. Once you reach the checkpoint at Tovany, you are a mere stone's throw from the fields of Karava. I eagerly await your safe and, above all, triumphant return. Alright, pick up the last quest, and I guess we continue running on. Uh, you can get that from here, right? Yeah. Give or take. I'm hoping there isn't any more quests here. I don't think there is. No, I think this is the only one. How are those new boots treated you? You. I know, man. Finally, no one was paying me the slightest heed. Is something wrong? At the university, the students would hang on my every word. Sadly, this far from home, I'm just a vagrant greybeard. The university? You're a scholar. A specialist in ancient cultures, the most accomplished in all Valisthea, some have said. Not that I look the part in these tattered rags. In my heyday, no obstacle could have kept me from my studies. Yet here I am, a wizened windbag, bested by the many steps of Tabor. The answers I seek lying. Oh man, is speaking in novels. He speaks for so long. Reach. Would you do an old man a kindness? My brain's just an autopilot doing this. In my stead? You'll be amply rewarded, of course. Sure. Oh, Go to stairs and... And memorize a few inscriptions for me. Uh, assuming you know your letters, that is. Oh, one thing I did uh, forget to mention, though. Courteous soul between episodes, I did do a quest that actually increased the amount of potions we can carry. And we did get also some upgraded potions as well that actually heal my health completely, though. That one's do a fair enough job, but yeah, I think we can hold four potions now and no, I think it's like six potions and four high potions, I believe. The otherwise undocumented origins of Tabor's unique yeah, people. something like that. Anyway, the people quite unlike those of Tabor. I was right. There was a way to get potions, I promise I'll remember everything which helps perfectly. because if I go up against another one like Titan, where I just have to spam potions and hope I live I'll live the entire attack. The well, make. For the yeah, domed yeah. pavilions, and you'll have no trouble finding the stones. Alright, let's move. Under the quest we go. So unfortunately I have to run the whole way down. And jump it? Nah. How are those new boots treating you? Boo. They need more games to just it's chill. Yes. Like they always have a barrier that I can't jump over. Just let me jump off. Like I'm gonna live regardless. Hell, I take on a giant dragon in normal form. I think I can jump off a ledge and live. Yeah. Who's this Sith? <laughs> Cloud's always just ready to just pummel someone. Cyril. How fair is the search? Well, your grace. My report shall be with you ere long. Ah, yes. Yote is otherwise engaged, at my behest. And the duty of wardenship? Fulfilled. 
For as you see, I've been reunited with my first shield. I am Cyril, knight of the undying and bearer of the burning. I am more undying. Charged with he kind of looks cool, but he kind of gives me Assassin's Creed vibes. Rosfield, keeper of the flame of the Phoenix and rightful Archduke of Rosaria. I entrusted Cyril here with overseeing the investigation into Ultima's origins. Findings from his brothers and sisters afield are delivered here to be collated and catalogued. Just how many undying are there? Not nearly enough, milady. Yet we are glad to give our all in service to the Phoenix. Such is and has ever been our creed. I see. You have your associates, I have mine. But you may now think of them as ours. That won't be a problem, will it? The Phoenix is our sun, and we but the shadows that quicken in his radiance. It is from the darkness that we serve, both him and now you. It really does give me Ezio vibes. Pray accept this token. Phoenix down. For as long as you bear it, members of our order will reveal themselves unto you. If there is nothing further. No. You are dismissed. Your grace. The canva then. We'll talk about this later. Zero I mean, yes. very let me mount up. Oh, it's gonna, keep it's gonna take me forever to mount up, you. isn't it? Hey, if we get past these choke words, we should be able to, right? Maybe once we get past these torches. The free cities and the sea. No. Yes. All right. There we go. We can speed things up a little bit. Let's go. Faster. No, we really have. Uh, we'll go for a little bit longer. We'll at least try and get to this zone. It feels like we've gone for a lot longer than we actually have been. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, we will. Orcs. Hey, the peeps. Then let us be rid Trying to make it to the zones. Look at this story progressing a little bit. I mean, we've progressed a little bit. I don't know how far we are from here. Surely we've got to go to the other island sooner or later, right? Because, I mean. Clive. Smoke. Has the city fallen? Probably. Got Prince Caspian and Odin running around. I think that's I think that's where they are anyway. Maybe not. I'm glad I got to look at that flag for twenty minutes. The three men are still holding their own then. Do we have any idea where Gav and the others might be? There's a warehouse near the docks where we agreed to meet if there was any trouble. We should hurry. Well, let's just go in the front gate. Like, we can whoop anyone's ass. We've got the Phoenix. If we just fuse together again, we've done what we need to. Look how many quests we have around the place. We actually have quests to pick up. Yeah, well, that ain't happening. Alright, <laughs> we're just leaving those quests. I just want to get this done at this point. I have three new games. I don't need to stack up again. That's why games get left behind, because there's just too many games at once. I just want to get this finished before the other ones drop. Sounds like thunder. You're late. <laughs> We're starting to think you'd stumbled off a cliff. I seem Go to love Gav, though. You, Gav. Oh, she's a uh, good to see. She's you. here. I totally forgot about Need her. I'm not gonna lie. Road. Nothing we couldn't handle. I knew you'd come. Is that who I think it is? Yes. Uh, allow me to introduce my brother, Joshua. 
Clive's told me all about you. How are even listening most of the time? Name's Middadol. But everyone calls you me. Don't your uncle. My lady. Hey. Josh was on the moon, damn. Go say hi to your uncle. My boy. Uncle Byron. <laughs> it's really you. I never thought I'd see the day. <laughs> Cute reunion. I mean, look at our squad we got now going. She was like blondie. Being controlled. She can't be trusted. That's she just runs off all like. the time. Empty eyes, eerie blue glow. No doubt they were turned. But silent as monks, every last one of them. Your man here speaks true, Clive. We saw more than a few in the city. They moved in ranks with a purpose. And not of their own. Ultima's doing. Perhaps. What of the city? The people? Uh, dead, mostly. Mostly, but not all. A handful managed to lock themselves in their villas before the horde arrived. Some in the merchant's district to the west, and a few of us on the far bank. Hmm. If the Akashic stumble across either hiding place, a few bolted doors won't hold them for long. We need to find them. And quickly. What do you propose? We split into two parties. I will make for the merchant's district, while you look to those across the river. Mind keeping an eye on my brother? Not at all. We find the villa and try the servant's entrance. Understood. And what of us? Mid, is she fit to sail? The ship? Uh, the mithril engine could probably do with a few more tweaks. Then you better work fast. Even if we do reach the survivors in time, they'll never make it to the hideaway on foot. You leave that to me. Hey, does that mean I'm traveling by myself this time? No, See, let's talk to us me at trouble, least. Think I can manage that? I'll keep him safe. Looks like you're stuck with me, Byron. That's Lord Rossfield, you little gutter snipe! Shall we then? And you keep Clive safe. At least we keep Toggle. Toggle's the only one I need. Both of you. You too. Toggle's a good boy. Alright, let's at least go to next. We might go to next checkpoint. Even for. Alright, Toggle. Alright, where are we going? Survivors. I guess I really only have one way to go, right? They don't stand a chance against those things. I'm gone. <sighs> Useless, they'll die instantly. Been you know oh, we're just gonna kill them this way then. Oh, wait, they're tanky level 20s. No, they're not, don't worry, I take it back. They all died. Ah, uh, maybe we should have left it for these guys. Whoops. Go down. The block goes. Oh, probably shouldn't have done this now. Yeah, we took a big damage hit from it. I like. We'll probably go to the next checkpoint and we might actually fall there for an episode. I know it's not really the most action packed episode, but we're starting to get into like a big showdown. Punch. No. 
Jack, can I charge up? Stop hitting me. I'm trying to charge. Okay, hit for hit. I'll take it. And dash and pummel you, and you dash and pummel me. Potion? Yeah, so it is six potions now. Do I wait for Phoenix and just take him out that way? I mean, we could. Over here. Let's do it. See how many we can take out with this ability, right? Okay, we took out some. Um. Toggle took them all on. Oh, someone did text us from behind, right? LA. LA. We had Toggle go Super Saiyan 1. We haven't seen Toggle go Super Saiyan again. I'm kind of sad because I want to see him go that form again. Alright, let's go and get this. Potion? No. I don't exactly know how far we're going. We might not even make it to the checkpoint. We'll see. Potion? I'm, just, I'm waiting for something to just jump out at me. There's gonna be something sooner or later. <laughs> they could just flying. What's up, dog? comes up so much faster now. I don't know why. I feel like it literally goes down for like two seconds and comes back up. Good. I'm not gonna use it just to get damage off. Pummel. Falcon punch. Ground slam. Laser beam. Vision off. 51,000. There we go. That's what we want to see. Big damage. I'm so glad they all, they all actually came off like perfectly. There you go. Max on potions now. Like the guy in the background. Oh, yeah. gonna have to fight. He's going to heal everyone. Oh one now. Oh, there's a chest here. Yeah, I really feel like it's coming up. I don't know if it changed or not. Goodbye. Exploit them all. Level up! There we go! I not even do, need to do side quests, it just levels me up anyway. Oh, there's not a, I thought there was an item there. A lot of gill, anything in here? More gill. Because that's definitely what I need. Because <laughs> that's definitely what I'm missing out on. That's well, not big. Joshua and Jill must be busy. I can't use it just yet. Big boy. Go. Go. 
Yeah, the fi that up attack really does go back. Because it's hello, where'd you come from? Ugh. It's really it's coming up so much quicker. I don't know why. I think they've changed it. Did absolutely no damage to it. Right, let's just wait. I'm gonna go big ham on it. Clear three, so we're still higher. Pounded in. Uh, I mean, I thought I dodged it. I just got hit with the second part of it. Fine. Come on. Stop. Oh, we really missed it. That's unfortunate, isn't it? We could have done more damage. I think my, my Phoenix ability missed. I keep jumping into it. Bye, it doesn't matter. I'll tank it. Boom! I mean, he don't. He literally dodged it. Big boy down. Where the city's leaders gather. Hey, the buddy. Be survivors in sight. Go straight ahead. Oh, things not even on this side. What's this? High potion. Another chest. Yes, that was right. The max is now four. Where? Breath. Whatever it was. More potions. Where are they? Well, this looks like a battle arena. To some extent. These creatures. Oh. Ultimus reaches Wrong ability. Far. Kill him this way. What the hell is going on really? Here? Oh no, he died. Where is your master? What does he want? I don't know. This one. I am my own master. What's that? Oh, kill. We got them. We got them. To me. Time to get you. Goodbye. What? You've caused quite the commotion. Who are you? But then I would expect no less oh. from you, Mirthos. My boy's joining the fight. Hello, Prince Caspian. You again. I don't believe we've been introduced. We might you go to the end of this fight and call it there. And now you're here with an army of Akashic thralls. Manners, Lord Rosfield. They are men, like you and me. Albeit this guy's wearing armor. He doesn't look like someone who would need armor to fight. The wills that drive our kind to madness. They are pure. They are divine. What? And they are all that remains in this once raucous city. You'll pay for what you've done. As you wish. I confess I have been very much looking forward to this. Pardon me this indulgence, your majesty. The vessel shall not be spoiled. I am slain men of House Harbor. And you will yield. I mean, he does have a sick design. I ain't yielding to you, though, buddy. As long as you don't hold back. Get him! Oh. 
These are all right by the time we get the bar back up. Right down! Ah, huh, I'm moving. Oop, this is all good. Right, we're gonna wait, we're gonna wait, and we're gonna go all out. We're gonna go full Efrit. How much damage we can dish out on him? Running fast. Yeah, Phoenix, Phoenix really should be up too. Gonna go real ham on him. I don't want to waste my ability, so we're just gonna wait. This one. Oh, it's gonna be bad. Keep going. Almost there. Over here. Go to Get him. No. Too slow. Missed. Can you imagine, like, being in this case, just being like, a, someone has an ego that always wants to hit someone. But, like, the enemy you're going up against just dodges everything. Like, you can get so infuriated. Oh no! Stop up! I stopped up. I was meant to use. I thought I was in fire form. I was not. I didn't charge up my ability at all. I mean, it did a lot of damage to him, but yeah. Stopped up a little bit, unfortunately. Where'd you go? Trick. He's a fuck. You will forgive me if my performance seems uninspired. It is just that I expected so much more from our chosen one. Perhaps this will kindle your flame. What now? A gift from my liege lord's armory. Gungnir. What That's a sick weapon. Thos? I'm still gonna dodge it. Yes! <laughs> if I do, man. Dodge everything. Nice try. I mean, you'll come down eventually. We've got so many waves coming out. We wait and go all out again. I think well, back when I played Final Fantasy. 14 or whatever the online one was. I'm pretty, because I played a Dragoon. I'm pretty sure this was the Dragoon weapon. Get there eventually. Play in close. Go! We've got all the abilities up this time. We're going to see if we can get 60,000. Grab what we are. Teleporting, you ass. 
Out of the sky, asshole. There, we punched him. Oh boy, fifty two thousand experience. God damn. Okay, the vessel is strong. Hi, Prince Caspian. Clive! You all right? Well, they joined Is after the battles safe? ended. <laughs> we are, yes. I'm sorry, but we couldn't save them. It was over before we arrived. Well, you did what you could. I fear we were all too late. What's wrong? Nothing. I hope. I wonder if he was one of the... Oh! Just some invisible slash came out of nowhere. Leaving so soon, Mythos. It's the king. Indeed, you may kneel before Barnabas Tharn, warden of. I didn't think we'll be going up against him straight away, but okay. <laughs> Maybe a little bit longer episode than I thought. Yeah, I killed your lackey. Did my lord commander yet i see why my master covets you so the power within you mythos the potential stop calling me mythos but mythos is everything the cornerstone of all creation the lord's vessel your purpose Purpose to surrender my mind and body to that thing. No, Your Majesty. My purpose is my own. I made a promise to my friends, to my people, and nothing is going to stand in my way. You would allow this delusion of free will to bar your path to greatness? Truly, your volition is a cancer, one that must be excised.
That is a sick weapon knife. Try it. Don't tell me she's gonna die here. Can't really afford to keep using her power. I mean, she could have hopped on the other side and made a wall, but she's gonna die here. Oh, well, he's got my sword at least. Not sure what. Sometime later. Did Jill just get executed off screen? Will he be alright? The Phoenix can mend flesh, but the spirit must recover on its own. I'm afraid the rest is up to him. This is remarkable. Outfitting it must have been no small feat. But why go to such trouble? That beauty's belly's filled with wonders the world ain't ready for. If the guilds caught wind of what we were up to, they'd all want a piece. All right. And how is he? Do not blame yourself. He was barely breathing when you brought him here. We would have lost him if it were not for you. No. Barnabas may have severed nigh every sinew in my brother's body. But he made certain the wounds were not fatal. Nigh every sinew? <laughs> Allow me, your lordship. Don't know what I was thinking. Put me to the trouble like that. <laughs> Tis no trouble carrying comestibles to my ailing nephew. I know, but... You've already done so much for us. Pouring your gill into the hideway and now the ship. I don't want to take the piss. You risked your life. And for what? Some gill you hardly know. Why'd you do it? You got mad or something? I wouldn't go that far. Clive! You're awake, my boy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what I want to do is help. And the world won't save itself. It was Sid. Father. The question is, where the hell was Joel? Did she get herself killed? Sounds like him. She got slashed in the eyes from the looks of it. Don't you dare do that again. What of the royalists? Fucked off, a lot of them, along with the galleon. With the king on board, no doubt. Behind her, yeah, I wouldn't say without him. Clive. Jill didn't come back. What do you mean? She kept the king busy while the others dragged you out. I don't think she died. She's, I reckon she's still there somewhere. She's probably captured or the something. Arachnid. Jill is fine. 
the ether of her icon endures. As long as it does, we can be certain that she is alive. We must pursue the Black Galleon. Jill will be with the King, I'm sure of it. Well, good luck catching him, because my ship's going nowhere. It's the Mithril engine. She's got a kick like a wild chocobo and a mind to tear the hull in half. But do you have an idea? Uh, well, of course I do. My dad'll have seen this coming a league off. If I had his old writings... If you had his old writings, you'd be sitting under a fuckload of rubble. The ones Otto didn't save anyway. I suppose you might still have a few pages in his stores. We'll have to hope it's enough. Do what you can to ready the ship. I'll speak with Otto. In your condition, you really are mad. <laughs> Perhaps. But the world really won't save itself. Now. More quests to pick up. Woo! I mean, we got a we got a pretty wafty length today. Hopefully, we get a spot where we can save anything. Okay, we do. Song of Hope. All right, we're gonna pause it here. If anything else happens, we're gonna end this episode off here. I do hope you enjoyed this episode. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell to know when the videos go live, and we'll be back again tomorrow, continuing on with this. I hopefully try and get it finished by the end of the week. If not, hopefully by the if not by the end of the week, hopefully next week, because I don't want to get caught with another four games all at once. It, it just becomes too much of a... It just becomes exhausting. But anyway, that being said, I'll be back again next time. So until then, take care and peace out.